Rock, paper, scissors. Rock, paper, scissors. My number one pick is Kristoff oh, from he, Frozen. He's a stud. Big, beefy, thick. He's not a number one pick, but he's oh, that's a no. good start. He is. Like I could, he's just like he's caring. Yeah, but he just cuts ice. Man, what else are you going to talk about? I, I, I'm not asking him to talk. <laughs> My okay. number one pick, Li Shang from oh. Mulan. I'll give you that. Stud. What are you two going to talk about? You don't speak Mandarin. I'm just going to say, let's get down to business. Okay. To do more than just defeat the Huns. That's not what I'm saying. <laughs> oh, you're such a nerd. What about that? That's pretty Is cool, he number huh? two for you? No. Number two is King Triton from The Little Mermaid. Okay, he's on my list. He's not that far like, on my list. He's but... like, it's not fish. He's not a fish. He's a merman. He's a daddy. He is a daddy. Mm. So he's, he's kind of... Got the beard. He's kind of sexy. Got and muscles. he's got that voice and... You know, and he's got abs. Speaking so. of voice, my number two, this is going to be really weird. We're about to get really weird. Okay. Thomas O'Malley from uh, the Aristocats. The Aristocats. Thomas O'Malley. That yeah, cat, the, the voice on that cat. Whew! Yeah, he's a country singer. Well, he was. I mean, that's from the 60s. So he's Phil Harris. So my number three pick is Flint Rider from Tangle. I just love the name. Sarcastic, funny. Sexy, I love when he keeps bringing it up. They never get my nose right in those wanted posters. They never got my chin right. Like it's just, he's funny and he's caring. Sarcastic, funny, sexy, caring. It sounds like you're describing me. Yeah, you wish. Before we get to the rest of them, real quick, we started an Amazon storefront so you can go and buy our Out Loud branded merch. Oh, cool. So that hopefully it can fund Brian finally seeing Flint Rider one day. Yes, yes, and meeting him in person. Back to the game. My number three, I can't believe he has gone this far without being selected, Jack Sparrow. Mm, Come on. Dirty. He, I mean, he yes, smells. he's gonna smell like rum and be dirty and gross, but sometimes. <laughs> but besides that, look at his teeth though. I'm a teeth guy, you know that. And this like goes back to almost when I was like six years old when I realized I was gay and then this Tarzan. Tarzan, that loincloth just yeah, peeking out. Trust yep. me, he, and as a kid, I remember when there was a real life television show, Ron Eli played the actor. I used to just sit in front of the TV and say, that loincloth has to come up. <laughs> and I mean, I'm like seven years old and I'm like, that loincloth has to come up, but never did. But I think like the way they have the animation, his hands are big, his feet are big. It's got this tiny waist. Oh, oh my gosh, she's like, Sexy, he's got some hair going. Not that I'm into long hair, but I'm like, he's, again, caring, cares about the environment, like he's awesome. We're getting weird again for my number four. Lightning McQueen. <laughs> no, <laughs> Lightning's got it going on. He's got it going on. Owen Wilson, he's I like a, the voice. I just like, again, caring, just, you know, you could have a lot of fun with Lightning McQueen. V8. He's got a V8. <laughs> All right, well, I have I more. I feel weird, I just feel weird by saying that. I, I picked a cat and a car for two of my picks. Well, I'm, I'm going, I'm going. Oh, he's going. For a threesome. Timon and Pumbaa. <laughs> Hakuna Matata, baby, yes, I agree with you. <laughs> I, and, and I, I, I remember reading something last week and it's like, look at two guys raised a king, so it's like, they did. They raised Simba, so they were like they parented together. The gays are fit a, to be was, parents, which I thought was hilarious. As so evidenced by I a do, warthog and a meerkat. I do. I do have. Well, you do your five. Oh, well, King Triton was an honorable mention for me. I'll, I'll start okay. there. Number five. We're keeping it again in the animal kingdom. Shere Khan. Oh. Shere Khan from uh, the Jungle Book. Really. I just want to make love to that voice. Yeah, he's just like obnoxious. I just love the he's voice. A mean guy. Yeah, but imagine that behind you. Well, you here's, know what I mean. Well, here's me then. Here's my honorable mention, Bagheera mm, from Jungle Book. Bagheera. You know, I'm into kind of these the big cat videos and like people. Well, like you are him. a big. <laughs> so. <laughs> I don't think you can say that. <laughs> so, but Bagheera. But my other honorable mention yeah. is Merida. From What's Brave. That? Merida from Brave. I'll fight for me own hand. 
Like she is girl power, oh. girl power, girl power. But my last honorable mention is uh, Clayton from Tarzan. He is he is a daddy for sure. Oh, yeah. He's a very but, mean, but he's very mean, why mean is he keep person. Like Shere Khan, this guy mean. What's wrong with Villains. mean? Sometimes you need a little Villains. angry. F oh, you know. Yeah. <laughs> Whoa. Well, all right then. My last honorable mention then is Gaston. Well, because like he's he's a big beef dad. No one. F like Gaston. Right. <laughs> so, so, I don't think you can say. So there's our there's our top five plus, you know. Who are yours? Let us know. Comment below which Disney characters you wish were gay. Surfer bro. You know his name? Silver Surfer. Yeah, no, he had a real name. But he surfs. I think it's like Greg Norris or he can, something. Like he that. can hang 10 wherever so, he wants with me. Yeah, you wish. <laughs>